everybody. Welcome again to another edition of TaylorMade Talk. I'm Chris Taylor, and today we're going to be talking directly to dog trainers. In the past, we have talked a lot to people who have questions about how to train their dogs or how to maintain their dogs or uh, how to keep their dogs. Today, we're going to talk to dog trainers um, about how to build their dog training professional business or about how to just to be a canine professional in general. Uh, I feel that uh, both sides um, carry a lot of relevance to them and I feel like I can really help people out with that because I've built several pieces of my business that have a lot to do with uh, being a canine professional up from the ground up and, uh, and I'd like to kind of share some of my experiences with you. How do you measure success in your business? <laughs> Oof. Um, that's a great one. Um, I, I can tell you a lot of ways I don't measure success first. And uh, I'll tell you, it's, it's not measured by material things. It's not measured by, hey, we can build this kitchen or, you know, we have a cool artificial turf training field or uh, any pos material possessions we have, uh, you know, that ha had a cool tailor-made truck, uh, things like that. Um, but it, it's, uh, and it's not how many Instagram followers you have, although, you know, we hit, we hit a nice number of them or Facebook followers and, uh, or Yelp reviews or Google reviews or Facebook reviews or whatever it may be. It's not, it's not about those. And those aren't the numbers or anything I measure success upon. Although those are nice, those are all pieces of it. Don't get me wrong. It's great to have 10,000 Instagram followers. It'd be nicer to have 10 million. But um, <laughs> um, so please follow our Instagram. But um, it's, uh, it's not about that. That's not really w what I'm looking at. And um, it, at, at all, I, I don't care about those material things so much. I mean, I do. There's, like I said, it's all part of it. But um, the measure of success, I think, is... Uh, our ability to help people. And um, I'll explain that as it kind of kind of sounds a little generic the way I answer that. Um, but when people come to us with a problem, our ability to solve as many or all problems as possible is what I feel our measure of success is. So uh, when people start out in training dogs, a lot of times they don't do certain things. They don't handle certain issues. They don't do aggression cases. They don't do certain breeds. They don't do uh, a, a lot of problems that they're not capable of solving or accomplishing or um, uh, dealing with. And for us, um, uh, uh, my measure of success is that we're able to, when people come to us with a problem or, or an issue or, or even something they want to accomplish, um, it's that we are able to address and accomplish any and all problems that come about. And again, I think that's, that helps by us looking at things theoretically versus trying to look at things of how to do certain things. Um, so we look at the bigger picture and then go to the how to do certain things. Um, but uh, yeah, our ability to handle problems, our ability to solve people's problems, our ability to help people um, every single time they come, uh, that's the measure of success. It's not the, it's not the uh, material things that come along with it or all the goodies that we get to buy and have or be around or deal with. And all that is fine. And it's great that now we're able to, to be in a place that we can have all these nice things and, and and, uh, and tools and, and, and stuff that helps us along the way and accomplish the goals that we have. Um, those are all great, and, uh, but it doesn't, those aren't the measures of our success. The measures of our success are, are that we can help every single person that walks through our gates. So if you enjoyed what you saw today here on TaylorMade Talk, please hit the subscribe button. Um, follow us on social media at TaylorMade Working Dogs. Um, that's important too. Send us your comments and your questions, please. If you like this video, like it. Um, comment on it if you have any questions or comments that you want to give us. Um, you can also send us questions uh, on email, info at tmwdogs.com. And we'd love to hear from you and uh, keep them coming. Thanks.